humans are, to the best of our knowledge, the only species that monitors time left throughout our lives. Early in life, we see time and the future as vast and open-ended. And the older we get, the more we come to see our futures as constrained by time. If there's a paradox of aging, it's that when we have these constraints on future time, we actually function better emotionally. Hi, my name is Laura Karstensen. I'm professor of psychology and founding director of the Stanford Center on Longevity. And this is why my research matters. Constraints on time bring us to shift our goals from ones about exploration and taking risks and learning and addressing difficult challenges to goals that can be realized in the moment. Goals about savoring life, goals about appreciation of others. My research focuses on motivational changes that occur across adulthood that contribute to changes in emotional experience and cognitive processing. These changes in motivation are very much related to our time horizons. And when people make that shift away from exploration and into something that looks more like savoring, life feels better and emotional experience improves. At the Center on Longevity, we are understanding how and then beginning to build a world that supports century-long lives. The metric of how long we lived changed and got much longer very suddenly in historical terms. We now have an opportunity to rethink how we live our lives so that quality of life improves at all ages and stages of life, not just in old age.